what's up everybody so got this dent pulled out got a uh, well there's still some but it's better than what it was uh, about to i'll lay five, uh, bondo down make it all smooth um took my wheel off got the wheel well trim off um to make my cutting line i just used the uh, rear rocker trim that goes right here and then i traced it i'm gonna cut above the line and go all the way around that's what i'm working on right now i got my bumper off i moved the exhaust the bumper uh bolts bumper bolts i believe are where's that deep socket at that i was using i think it's five eighths i'm not sure but I got my bumper, I took that off, um, moved my exhaust, I used some rebar tie down wire and moved that. Uh, this size socket right there, that is half inch socket. And then the, bra the brace that holds this, you got to move that out the way. That is a 15 millimeter. And then... Right now, I am drawing out the template of this, where I'm going to use the uh, cut on the inside. So I'm drawing that piece out, and I'm going to cut it out, I'm going to tape it on there, and then um, and draw my cutting lines like that. I have my wheel well trim and bumper. Uh, guard, not bumper guard. Um, what is that shit called? Motherfucker. Well, I got that inside the car. Um, I'm gonna wait to do the rust -oleum shit later. But hey, it's almost done. Oh, here's the um, size for the bumper bolts. It's yeah, it's 15 millimeter for the bumper uh, bolts that hold it in place. There's four on each side, and then if you gotta replace your bumper shock you will take this bolt out right here these four and then this entire thing slides out but a uh, little update show you what I'm doing told you I'd cut y'all back on before I started cutting this piece off and welding it and um, hopefully this shit's done here soon just making a quick video not too bad what y'all think